This is my second dive, actually. My first dive, the camera for malfunction turned off. And I did not get my first fish that I shot on camera, but we're out here at the buoy line looking for spade fish that we can shoot. We're usually picking out the bigger ones. We really saw like seven to 10 pound fish. And we're looking for our three man limit, which is 12, per, or 12 fish in all, four per person. And we are being really selective with the fish. On this dive, I dive down, line up perfectly, and I don't shoot because it didn't turn the way I thought it would, and I didn't want to kill the fish. We are diving anywhere from 10 to 20 feet down, duck dives. We're sitting in about 70 feet of water, so some pretty decent dives for these fish, which they were sitting a little far down and they were a little bit spooky, so we kind of had to work for them. All these spade fish. This box. You get one? Hold her up. Pull that thing up. Put a jar or more on it, and I sniped that in the face. <laughs> yeah, boy. That's sick. All right. Oh, they're right here. All right. Now I hop back in the water. I'm looking for trigger fish and little buoy jacks to shoot for cup bait for later. And here, I actually shoot one. I shoot two. Then I get some video of Carter and we head out to Rudy. <laughs> And now we are in Rudy Inlet. Um, we were looking to catch croaker and small fish for cobia fishing, but couldn't catch any. So we're diving the jetty now, looking for anything. Sheep's head, spade, well, we can't shoot any more spade fish. Um, flounder, drum, and um, they actually shoot two sheep's head. I don't shoot anything. I miss a couple, but it was a good little experience.
also a buddy shot. That's one of them. And the other one is...